thank you for joining your channel new channel of retro gaming this is r2d1 yeah in this video we're going to be reviewing the infamous rg 350 this is the heritage that we got from the chinese from the from the COVID boots, you know. Uh, at least they give us this to play with. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So in this video, we're going to be reviewing the king of handhelds, the Chinese console. They fucked us with the lockdowns and all that crap, but at least they designed this baby for us. To enjoy your quarantine a little bit better, right? <laughs> Ironic. Okay, so this baby got the cross. Yeah, directional buttons. Button feels not the best thing, but they're doing their function. Style button. R2, R1. Here is the slot of USB 2 to port to the computer. The headphone jack, HDMI, HDMI, I don't think this works. And a second USB, the L2 button, the L1, the select. And the pad, this is the first version because later on they change this path they change this cross over here and they change this analog stick over here also here in the back we can put an extra memory card this is the power button the set and the volumes okay let me show you the emulators that this baby can run a cannibal cannonball is outrun and I run an outrun port can play DOS FBA is is arcade system Nintendo Sega Genesis Game Boy Game Boy Color PlayStation Sega Genesis Retro Arches, multi application of emulation, Game Boy Advance, Super Nintendo. This is the Nintendo 64 emulator, but don't run really well. It's useless installing on it because don't run really well. And Mame is also an arcade. Emulator got here a port of Minecraft, a shitty one. Frogger Descent, this is a good one. Doom and Super Mario 64. This is running through an open dingo, open dingox. This is a Linux application itself.
Nintendo 64 emulator is useless. It's so laggy. Okay, so this baby got a large capacity of long-lasting battery life. The battery can the battery can last up to five hours if it's fully charged. This is the Retro King handheld of 2020. And right now you can get one of those for just 80 bucks. Thank you to this model came along a lot of more different models of Unburnic but this is the first version the RG350 so in the comment below I'm gonna leave a couple of links in order for you to download emulators and also some ports if you want to I hope you like the video and see you in the next one